on the 12th day of Christmas, my teacher said to me, The bell doesn't dismiss you. No one's allowed on the field. I need a volunteer. It's your time that you're wasting. Stop swinging on your chair. Get rid of that chewing gum. We're gonna have a seating plan. Why do I hear talking? Because you've got ears, you massive melt. You must wear a blazer and your tie like this. Don't forget black socks. And if you broke it, put a paper towel on it. Merry Christmas, you old flutes. Happy New Year, students! What's happy about it? And welcome back to school. I was really hoping this place would have burnt down over the holidays. Gary, that's a terrible thing to say. I'll piss off. Gary, do not speak to me like that. But why? You know what? In my 372 years of teaching, you, along with this class, are the worst I've ever had. Thank you very much. That wasn't a compliment. <laughs> Okay, Gary, tell me something you learned over Christmas. I learned that feces are stored in the mouth. Don't be so silly, Gary. What makes you think that? Well, you prove it because all you do is talk shit. <laughs> Hi everyone. Hello. I hope you had a happy Christmas. Nah, I got in a fight with my nan over Monopoly. 2022 was tough. I know, look how much I've aged. I'm not going to pretend that all our problems will go away in the new year. Well, why not? In this historic year of His Majesty the King's coronation. Now, I'm sorry, but His Majesty still doesn't sound right to me. Yes, 2023 will have its challenges. I just want a nice chill year. But the government I lead is putting your priorities first. Yeah, but is it true you want all school students to study maths until the age of 18? Yes. Nah, f that. Has everyone done the homework? My cat ate it. I've heard of dogs eating homework, not cats. I accidentally dropped it down a drain. How? I did it, sir. Oh, behave. A pigeon flew down and stole it from my hands. Seriously? The police confiscated it as evidence. These excuses are getting worse. Michael, can you send me a copy of the homework? Why haven't you done it? My washing machine broke. What has that got to do with anything? Don't know. All right, download Cam Scanner. What's that? It's an all-in-one scanner app. All oh, right. It allows you to instantly scan, save, or share any document. Yeah, but which formats? PDF. Nice. JPEG. Sick. Word. Blimey. And the app is free to download. Wow. It's so simple to use, which is great for you. Download Cam Scanner now and I'll send you over the homework. A few moments later. Thanks for sending me the homework, mate. Just sent it to Sir now. You changed it a bit before sending it, right? Um. Right. Um. Gary Michael outside now. Twenty twenty three. I'm still trying to get my head around twenty twenty. When you start a new year, I think it's normal to look back on the previous year. And I'll be honest, the last twelve months have been the hardest I've had to go through. When my dad passed away, it was really sudden. Like I was with him on the Tuesday, and then that Thursday, so two days later, I had to pretty much break down the door because he wasn't answering, and I had to find him. You know, and what followed was was me spiraling out of control. I wasn't eating, I wasn't sleeping, I wasn't washing. I mean, blimey, I must have stank. But I just didn't see the point in anything. And that was a question I kept asking myself, what's the point? I, I just didn't see the point in living anymore. I've never actually said this out loud, but I contemplated just, just, uh, contemplated just ending it but thankfully as time went on not only did I have good people around me but I had you old flute supporting me even if the videos I was posting weren't as good it's cool we can be honest and listen I'm not saying any of this for attention or sympathy I just know there'll be a lot of you out there going through a tough time right now and maybe you're asking the question what's the point I just want you to know there is always a point and this year will have its ups and it will have its downs but so many good times are coming your way even if right now it doesn't feel like it so please make sure you're here to see it but I mean, we're barely a week into the new year and I'm already crying. That's got to be a new record. <laughs> This has been a tough winter. Yeah, I can't afford to put the heating on, mate. Me and my cat are freezing. I know. Well, do something then. That takes leadership. Oh, where's Buzz Lightyear when you need him? Restore pride in the United Kingdom, our great country. Why do all these politicians talk to us like we're in year two? I was brought in to fix those challenges. All right, Batman, calm down. We can bring everyone together. Mate, last week, people were literally battering each other over that prime drink. Oi, just for banter, say the word now. Now? <laughs> I will not let you down. Yeah, my ex-girlfriend said that and then she cheated on me of a hedgehog. All right, anyway, in one word, what shall I do next in terms of getting with Zendaya? Stop.
In maths I started snoring. Detention. I think science is proper boring. Detention. I ate a jar of mayonnaise at the talent show. Detention. Apparently I walk too slow. Pace and precision. I got caught listening to some music. Detention. How are you a teacher because you're so thick. Detention. I got caught eating cereal in the classroom. Detention. I did this whilst I was on Zoom. Gary, detention. What? When did World War II start? After World War I, who invented the telephone? Apple. What does the BC stand for in the year 48 BC? Before COVID, who was Henry VIII? A slag. When did the Cold War end? In the summer. Get out. What's the difference between fiction and non-fiction? The word non. What is Macbeth? Is that a new burger from McDonald's? Give me an example of a fact. You're a twat. What did Shakespeare mean when he wrote, the man's shoes were red? He simply meant the man's shoes were bloody red. Oi, sir, spell the word I cup. I-C-U-P. Oh, sir, you're disgusting. <laughs> I hate my life. Happy birthday to me, um, Gary. Happy birthday to me, Gary. Happy birthday, dear Gary. Gary. Happy birthday to me, Gary. Bloody hell, do you get a pound for every time you say my name? Gary, I know it's your birthday, but you need to calm down. Sir, you're just jealous you're not invited to my birthday party tonight. Um, I have better things to be doing with my time. Like what? Like feeding my fish. <laughs> Gary, do not laugh at me. But why? Right, that's it, Gary. Get out. Okay, sir, before I go, can I say one thing? Go on, then. I typed idiot into Google yesterday, and guess what came up? What? A picture of you! <laughs> school trips. First thing is, first school trips meant no classes. <laughs> But then your teacher would pipe up and say, Remember, you're representing the school. But then they'd tell you to partner up with someone and you'd get excited and look at your mate like... The best bit about any trip was the coach journey. The race for the back seats was more savage than two alcoholics fighting over a bottle of vodka. There's that great moment when your squad turns into a mini choir. Everywhere we go! Everywhere we go! One kid would be sick everywhere and the coach would smell worse than your nan's feet. Did any of you go to a theme park? You'd all be hyped for it. But once you got there, is every other school on the planet here as well? And speaking of other schools, the minute you saw a rival school, you'd react like this. Primary school. There was being taught to play this. Why? They were singing Jesus classics. Kumbaya, my lord! And they was hearing this famous line. Sir, Alice broke my heart. If you broke it, then you put a paper towel on it. If you got in trouble, you had to go and face the wall like some kind of convict. What about my human rights? If you had to make a big decision, you'd use this. Shall I punch myself in the face? And primary school is where the most savage comeback was created. Ugh, you're such an idiot. I know you are, but what am I? <laughs> Hello, you old flutes. My favourite moment in primary school wasn't playing the recorder. It wasn't belting out Jesus classics. For me, it was getting one of my classmates, Gary, to swap me his shiny Charizard for my standard Pikachu. I said, Gary, the Pikachu is the most famous Pokemon. It's very hard to get. It's so rare. <laughs> oh, so Gary, if you're watching this, I am sorry. Oh, you mother f Sir, you smell worse than my nan's armpit. Right, Stevie, you're going on the board. <laughs> Today, we will be your face makes onions cry. Okay, Michael. You look like a sloth. Jason, you look like a fish. Alice, I expected better from you. I'm jealous of students who don't have you as a teacher. Sarah, the only girl you've ever kissed is your mum. Roadman Reese, you are more disappointing than when the McDonald's ice cream machine is broke. Tarquin, you suck. Right, Benjamin, you as well. That's eight of you. Anyone else? You're as thick as Kim Kardashian's bum. Get out. What's that? You're not making none of those annoying and aggravating noises. Alarm clocks zero. Students all over the country one. I've actually got so much homework to do this week. Do I do it now and get it out the way? Or later in the week? <laughs> later in the week. 
Since you haven't got school this week, there's a list of chores waiting for you on the kitchen table. Chores? More like bores. I'm so bored. I wonder what Alice is doing. Let me text her. Seven hours later. She read it seven hours ago. The cheeky cow. I still haven't done any of that homework. It's fine, I'll do it over the weekend. What day is it? Sunday. What day is it tomorrow? Monday. Do I have school tomorrow? Yes. Ah! Who wrote the book of Mice and Men? Andrew Tate. Right, that's a detention. What for? You're not allowed to say that name in this school. Oh my God. Okay, back to my question. Who wrote the book? Right, that's it. Who's talking? Me. Gary, of course it's you. <laughs> What's so funny? No, nothing. No, come on, I could do have a laugh. Well, look in the mirror then. Gary, you're on thin ice. But I can't skate. Do you think that's funny? A little bit. Gary, you're not funny. Nothing you do is funny. You're simply an embarrassment. What do you have to say to that? Oh, sir, why don't you fuck off? <laughs> Hi. Hello. I'm Stevie. I'm Harry. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. How did your teachers talk to you back in school? Harry. Well, my teachers to me were like, Stevie, stop being a twat. <laughs> All right. What advice would you give to people who are constipated? Not to worry too much about what comes out mm. and just kind of let it happen. Do you remember where we first met? Uh, we met in Italy. Yeah, and you stole that girl from me. Sorry. And did you know that I loved her? I did know that. You're an absolute disgrace. Sorry. I just don't think I'll ever get over this. Sorry. Stop saying sorry! Sorry. Oh, I don't need this. Sorry. English at school. You're taught everything from nouns to verbs, metaphors to similes. But do you remember any of it? Hell no! Ugh, there's that moment when a teacher asks for a volunteer to read. Don't look at him, don't look at him. But there are different types of readers. The ones who read like it's a Barack Obama speech. The ones who read so fast you think Eminem has turned up. And the ones who read like this. David, um, pooped, I mean, popped down to the shop. Oh, this is long. Don't get me started on poems. The poet would write, the man's shoes were red. And what did your teacher think this meant? The man's shoes symbolized the love and devotion he has for the lady in his life. But what did the poet actually mean? The man's shoes were red. And who else has trolled their teacher like this? Stevie, why aren't you doing any work? No need to, sir. And why not? I'm already fluent in English. Ah! Since I became prime minister, everything is still sh it, that is not coming to an end. Oh, great. So you may have seen the Chancellor's plan for growth at the budget. Nah, sorry, I was shaving my cat. And there's one announcement in particular that I wanted to highlight. You're going to create a Kinder Bueno McFlurry. Because I know that it will mean so much to many of you right now. You're going to make it illegal for your crush to leave you on red. And that's our plan to keep helping you with your energy bills. Oh, bollocks. We've prioritised helping families with the cost of living. All right, so how much are Freddo's going to be by the end of the year? £1,300. How much? All right, anyway, back in the day, I got a week's worth of detentions for locking a substitute teacher in a cupboard. What do you think of that? Tough, but fair decision. Oh, I don't need this. <laughs> your best mate. Now the peanut butter to your jelly. The milk to your shake. The mog to your... Stevie. <laughs> when someone else says your best mate is their best mate. <laughs> When your best mate tags someone else in a meme. Now you know what, mate, you're a snake. When you tag your best mate in a meme and they don't respond. Well, I'm sorry I bothered you with my existence. When your best mate gets a boyfriend or girlfriend. No offense, hun, but freeze a crowd. And double tap your screen if you've ever said this after doing something hilarious with your best mate. We should literally have our own show. But there's telling your best mate to look at the person behind them and not make it obvious, but they do this. That is getting your best mate to help you out of your social media posts. Mate, Instagram right now, like my photo. And your best mate is the only person allowed to be 100% honest with you. I'm gonna get back with my ex. Oh really? Yeah. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Over my dead body. Good evening. Hello, Boris, you old flute. The coronavirus is the biggest threat this country has faced for decades. Oh, I'm not sure that's true. You're forgetting that baby shark song. You should not be going shopping except for essentials like food and medicine. And use food delivery services. Hey, yo, Domino's, can I have an extra large pepperoni and put it on Boris's tab? You should not be meeting friends. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. <laughs> 
I'm sorry, say that again. You should not be meeting friends. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. <laughs> it's the way you say it, you should say no. <laughs> Boris, repeat that. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. Don't worry, Boris. I don't have any friends. <laughs>
Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, do 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 do. Okay, can I be honest with you? Yeah. Right, that was hideous. You have a second song? Yeah. Mommy shark, do 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 do. Mommy shark, do 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 do. Why is the audience reacting like that? They are here to judge you. You lot can't judge me. But they can judge your singing. Oh, whatever. It's three notes, but nice to meet you. Oh, shut up, Simon, you burk. It's 2.59. I thought they said 3 p.m. Blimey, can this country get anything right? I know the alert is coming. I'm ready. Ah! I didn't get it. Even the government doesn't want me. What the f***? Teacher sparks outrage for denying girl toilet break after she starts period. You gotta be f***ing kidding me. Let me know in the comments below if something like this has ever happened at your school. Because recently I did a video about teachers not letting students go to the toilet when they need to. And I was going to mention periods, but I thought to myself, nah, surely schools wouldn't go that far and not let girls go to the toilet when they need to. Well, I got that wrong, didn't I? So I called my sister, I called my cousins, and I asked them if they experienced this at school. And guess what? They did! You know, sometimes you need to use the toilets, but you don't want to say what for in front of everyone. It'd be like me saying something like, sir, can I go to the toilet? Why? Why? Because I need a massive sh Oh god no! Do you know what I mean? It's like it's none of your business, bro. Let me go to the toilet. So listen, I'm genuinely looking into writing a note for any student who needs one. So whilst I sort the logistics for that, double tap your screen if you want me to write you a note. I'm gonna focus and revise, and nothing will stop me. Mate, do you wanna go for a McFlurry? Absolutely. I regret not revising months ago. I've now got to cram a year's worth of work into one week. Shit. I can't be asked. I've got a photographic memory. Brain, remember all my notes for my upcoming English exam. Done. I should be revising, but I'm currently watching videos on how to open microwave doors. Gary, why are you not revising? Mum, why are you on your fourth marriage? <laughs> right, just for that, you're grounded. Oh, bloody hell. Are you all looking forward to the king's coronation? What? The king is going into Coronation Street? No. What? The king loves Coronation Chicken? No, Gary. So what are you saying then? The king is officially being crowned. There's only one king around here and that's me. Gary, you can't even remember to bring a pen to school. That's true, sir. But I do remember the time I locked you in a cupboard. Gary, let's not bring that up again. But why? Gary, let's also not start saying that again. But why? I can't wait until you leave. <laughs> Gary, put that stupid tongue back in your mouth. That's not what your mom said last night. <laughs> the crown held aloft and placed on the king's head. Sorry, Charles. There's only one member of royalty that I pledge my allegiance to. Not my king! Burger King! God save the queen the king! Come on, the coronation is on! Isn't that a TV show? No, that's Coronation Street. Alright, I was half right. The king is officially being crowned. Oh! Gary, are you playing games? No. What are those sounds then? That's Stevie. Gary, I can see your screen. Oh my God, stop stalking me. Are you still playing that game? Yes. What username are you using? Barack Obama's Barmy Army. Gary, get on with your work. But why? Gary, be quiet and send me a link to your work. Okay, sir, I've just sent it now. Thank you. Have you ever taken a test while drunk? Yep, yeah, my A-level business exam. Oh, hell no! The England football team were playing at Wembley the night before my 9am exam. My mates had a spare ticket. They asked me if I wanted to go. Now, a serious A-level student would have said no, right? But what did I say? Let's go! England win, the drinks are flowing, I've just spent £8 on a shit burger. Now for anyone who's been to Wembley, you'll know trying to get out of Wembley is harder than actually doing an A-level exam. I end up getting home at 3am. My final ever exam is in six hours. So basically I turn up to this exam feeling rougher than someone who's just been beaten up by Batman. You know I'm reading questions like, calculate the break-even quantity and revenue for the brand Abercrombie & Fitch.
I was like, bruv, what the fuck? Anyway, I somehow passed this exam, but it was the longest two hours of my life. So look, if anyone ever asks you to do something the night before an exam, remember what to say. Let's go! You can take out your pens and start writing now. Ah! I wish I would have revised now. When did we learn this? Can I have an extra piece of paper, please? Oh, shut up, Tarquin. Bogies! Gary, be quiet. But why? I think I'm gonna be sick. Alice, wait. <laughs> oh, it stinks! Many unbearable hours later. You have five minutes left. Ah! Psst. Michael, what did you put for question 10? 27. Psst. Jason, what did you put for question 10? 26. Oh no. Well, Gary, what have you put? I put Jamaica. <laughs> Gary, do you want to share that with the rest of the class? No, that's why I whispered it. Well, why are you talking in the middle of my lesson? Why are you teaching in the middle of my conversation? Do you want me to go and get the head teacher again? Oh, so you have to call the head teacher because you're not good enough to do your job? Gary, I'm warning you. Sir, you have the face of a man and the nose of a dog. Right, that's it, Gary, get out. Oh, why don't you lick my chicken nuggets, you little bitch? <laughs> Awkward situations. Trying to get past someone because a little something like this. Oh. <laughs> get out of the f***ing way. Catching someone's eye contact once. Twice. Okay, it's getting a little bit creepy now. But three times. Stop looking at me. Who else uses their phone as a way of looking busy? I'm on my own here. Let me get my phone out and pretend I'm doing something. You're somewhere quiet. Somewhere like an example. What does your stomach decide to do at this exact moment? I haven't eaten since breakfast. And who else ever experienced something like this? What do you call a dancing lamb? A ballerina. You suck. All right, mate, chill out, I'm 12. I'm going to eat this tub of butter in 20 seconds. <laughs> Everybody was kung fu fighting. Yeah. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. If you broke it, then you put a paper towel on it. Mm. You having a laugh? <laughs> I don't understand why we had to learn this. Was this your card? No. Bruv, you clearly forgot which card you picked. You're making me look like an idiot. I am brave. I am bruised. I am who I'm meant to be. This is me. Oh, shut up. What'd you say? School put lockable gates on toilets to stop children using them during lessons. Sir, can I go to the toilet? No, Steve, you should have gone at break. Have you seen the toilets at break? <laughs> My man dad stunned after baby son's first words are all right, bro. Oh, shut up. That's got to be a lie. <laughs> School bans bag so boy turns up carrying books in a microwave. Right, Stevie, pack your bag and get out. Oh, fine. <laughs> Mum's terrifying find in young daughter's bedroom. Oh, come on, it can't be that scary. When you go in your daughter's room, and she says, Mom, you've got a bunch of spiders up there. Look in the other corner. There's more. And they're alive. Ah! You can start now. Ah! Uh, when did we learn this? Hey, can I have an extra piece of paper, please? This is going all right, actually. I'm gonna be sick. You have five minutes left. Ah! The answer to question 10 was 7.2. Uh, no, the answer was 7.3. Gary, what did you put? I put Liverpool. 
Gary, are you vaping? No. Are you smoking? No. Why is there smoke everywhere then? Because I spit fire like a young William Shakespeare? What? G to the A to the R to the Y. Gary, that's me, that's me. Gary, that's enough. But why? Stop it. Sir, you have the brain of a fish and the skin of a pineapple. Um, excuse me, I am smart. Oh, sir, behave. You can't even drive a car. I'll have you know I'm a better driver than Vin Diesel. Ha! <laughs> Vin Diesel? More like Vin Petrol. <laughs>
Gary, this is a catalogue for sofas. <laughs>
I've forgotten how to use a pen. I know it's your first PE lesson of the year, but we are going to be doing a bleep test. Oh, f off. What? What? Let's go around the room and introduce ourselves one by one. Uh, let's not. New pen. New bat. Sir, you are a dirty slag. Get out. Welcome back to online learning. Oh, it's like deja vu. Why are we doing this again? It's not safe to be at our school right now. Ah, so you've realised Mr Nipple is an absolute weirdo. No, not that. There are concrete safety fears around the school building. This country's a joke. Okay, I want you all to tell us your name and a fun fact about yourself. Oh, f My name is Stevie and I've got a crush on Alice. Ugh. My name is Michael and I'm currently having a sh**. My name's Roadman Reese and I'm going back to sleep. Hello, my name is Gary and I... Uh, Gary, you cannot wear dressing gowns or pyjamas to school. Well, this isn't school, is it? It's online school and I won't tolerate it. Ha! What are you going to do? Send me home? <laughs> oh, piss off. You know, two years ago yesterday, my, my dad sadly passed away and I don't post these videos for sympathy. I post them for two reasons. One... I want to try and keep his memory alive as much as I can. And two, one of the main reasons I've been able to get through these last couple of years is, is because of you and the support so many of you have shown me. And I've come back to the village today that I grew up in, and more specifically, uh, this park where, oh man, I spent so much time, like every day after school, me and the boys and some legendary girls would meet down here and uh, we'd play football until it got dark. And, also, this was where um, I played for my local football team from the ages of five till I was 12 and my dad was the manager and I just kind of been sat here um, like reminiscing about uh, those times and um, where my dad would be shouting at me or telling me off if I wasn't, if I wasn't playing well, but also like beaming with pride if I, um, if I scored a goal or, or, you know, dribbled past a few players. And, and the football club is, is still going to this day. And I didn't know they were going to do this, but they did a, a minute's applause in honour of my dad, which I, um, I thought was, re was really beautiful. But anyway, I know, um, I know you're going to be bored of me saying this, but I'm going to continue to say it. Thank you so much for all your support, guys, not just over the last couple of years, but since I've been making videos, it, it really does mean more, more than you'll ever know. Sir, can I go to the toilet? No, Gary, you should have gone at break. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to plan my bladder schedule today. Are you talking back to me? Well, yes, that's how a conversation works. Don't get me angry. You won't like me when I'm angry. No one likes you anyway, sir. Right, I want total silence from you. Sir, you have the personality of a sausage roll. I said silence. But why? Silence! Sir? Gary, I said silence. Why am I still hearing you talk? Because you have ears, you stupid cow! <laughs> Instead of black, I used a blue pen. Detention. I got a piss in, now I want ten. Detention. I told Miss Karen she's a massive twat. Detention! I've got no friends, so I brought my cat. d d, -d tension Bruh. I got caught running down the hall. Detention. Hit Gary in the face with a tennis ball. Detention. I came to school wearing one shoe. Detention. I've got a face full of tattoos. I forgot to bring my PE kit. Detention. I told Alice I thought she was fit. Detention. I came to school with a bald head. Detention. I used my desk as a damn bed. D -d 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 Detention. I got caught with a bloody vape. Detention. Hit Gary in the face with a red grape. Detention. A Rick rolled, sir, and he fell for it. Detention. I fell over and my shirt split. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> I got caught running down the hall. Detention. I punk sir with a prank call. Detention. I put salt in sir's cup of coffee. <laughs> I stole Gary's prom king trophy. D -d 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 Give that back, you little sh**. I forgot to get my diary signed. Detention. Annoyed the sub teacher, so he resigned. <laughs> At break, we were playing British Bulldog. Detention. I said, Miss Fancy a snog. No. Aww.
Gary, stop playing with that recorder. But why? Because I said so. Well, why did we have to learn to play it back in primary school? Because it will benefit you in life. How? I don't want an argument about it. Yeah, because you know you'll lose. <sighs> right, class. Who wants to answer the three back-to-back -back questions? Yeah, I will, sir. Yeah, go on, sir, I will. Gary? Why are you picking me? I didn't even have my hand up. Okay, Gary, here we go. Which type of rock is the hardest? Dwayne Johnson. When air is moving, what is it called? A fart. What is the strongest force on earth? Kim Kardashian's bum. <laughs> Have you ever had a sub-teacher? I genuinely used to feel sorry for him. One of my classes back in school locked a sub-teacher in a cupboard and he quit the next day. <laughs> it kind of went down like this. Let me out. What's the password? I'm not going to tell you again. Okay, I am going to tell you again. Let me out. Sir, you need the password. <sighs> What's the password? Give me a tenner. <sighs> Fine. There you go. So what's the password? Uh, give me a tenner, no spaces, all lowercase. I am a clown. My Squishmallows Wendy is the best. Do you want to expand on that? A picture, or in this case, a Squishmallows, is worth a thousand words. Bosh. Nicely done. Okay, remember, this is hashtag find your squish. Your task is to convince the class why your squishmallows is perfect for you. My squishmallows is softer than Stevie's bicep. <laughs> Wait, what? And Carpio feels more amazing than when you get a text back from your crush. Ah. We all know squishmallows like Avery and Melzi are super soft and collectible. Mm -hmm. My squishmallows is stronger than a bodybuilder. Ooh. Faster than an Olympic sprinter. Ooh and can cook better meals than a gourmet chef. Ha Gary, is all of that true? No. But look how beautiful Mipsy is. I've definitely found my squish and she's the best one. Okay, students, great pictures. You all get an A, but you know sharing is caring. So come on, give me all your squishmallows. All together now. We do not share squishmallows. Learner driver spends £1,380 before finally passing theory test at 60th attempt. What is the difference between a green traffic light and a red traffic light? The colour! When going down a steep hill, what should you do? Turn the engine off to save petrol! What's the first thing you should do before starting the car? Make sure you find a sick song on your playlist. If you're being chased by a police car, what should you do? Pretend you're in GTA and see how many stars you can get. What should you do when approaching the rear of another vehicle? Give it a slap. Get out. Senior BBC News presenter caught giving middle finger to camera live on air. Oh, B.A., that didn't happen. Live from London, this is BBC News. <laughs> What did you put for question five? Nah, the worst thing you can do after an exam is discuss the answers. Well, I put 26. You put what? 26. It was 27. Uh, no, it was 26. No, I specifically read that question three times. It was 27. No, 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 no. You've got that wrong, pal. The only person who has got something wrong here is you when you decided to get that broccoli hairstyle. <laughs> That's a bit rich coming from someone whose hair resembles the contents of a cat's litter box. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's remember what's important here. And that is that the answer was 26. Uh, again, no, it was 27. Let's ask someone else. Gary, what did you put? I put microwave. What reason have you got for not doing the homework? I, I don't know the exact reason. Well, I want one. But it looks... Uh, as though it's something to do with the app going down. Well, the app didn't go down for your son who lives in the same house as you. Hi, Dad. Come on, I want to know why you're the only one in the class who hasn't done the homework. Um, but somehow uh, it, it, it automatically erasing all the things uh, between that date when, when it went down and the moment when it was last backed up. I want a technical explanation. I can't give you the technical explanation, but that's the best I'm able to give. No, that's it. Your name's on the board. Bruh. I think school uniforms should be better. <laughs> Gary, stop laughing. The reason I think school uniforms should be banned is because... <laughs> 
Gary, I need you to start being serious. Oh, sir, I need you to be quiet. Get on with the presentation. I don't think it lets students show off their personal. <laughs> Gary, if you laugh one more time, I'm gonna fail you. Okay. So, another reason why school uniforms should be banned is... <laughs> <laughs> no, that's it, Gary, you failed. I'm giving you a zero out of 10. <laughs> that's the same score you get when people get asked how good looking you are. <laughs> right, Stevie, you're up next. Oh, bloody hell. Mum outraged after daughter given harsh detention for burping in PE lesson. Hey yo, they're giving out detentions now for burping. The end is nigh. Let me know in the comments below some of the reasons that either you or someone you know got detentions for. Personally, I didn't get many detentions. The only reason I went to school was to play football at break and lunchtime. So there was no way I was going to have one of those taken away from me. However, there was this one fateful day. I was in GCSE business, but there was no teacher. Five minutes went by, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, still no teacher. Hey, so we're buzzing. And I have no idea why. But a massive food fight broke out. I'm talking crisps, chocolate bars, Capri Suns. But I sometimes take things a little bit too far. I picked up the ham sandwich that my mum made me. Sorry, mum. And I've just launched it at my mate's head. And I, I can still picture it now. This sandwich just bouncing off my mate's head and mayonnaise just dripping down his face. But who walked in the room the second I threw that sandwich? The bloody teacher! So yeah, I got a detention for throwing a ham sandwich at my mate's head. But do I regret doing it? Hell no! <laughs> You're pregnant with the son of God. <gasps> I'm pregnant. What? I'm gonna give birth to the son of God. The son of Gary? Mm -hmm. No. God. Oh, thank God. Wait, what? Come on, students, big smiles. Mary and Joseph arrive in Bethlehem. There is no room at the inn. Hey, old King Herod, congrats on your new baby son. What? What? Mm, I don't like children. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Have you got the gold? Nah, I sold it on Cash My Gold. What about the frankincense? Is that that monster thing? That's Frankenstein. Oh, have you at least got some myrrh? Some what? Myrrh. Bruv, I have no idea what that even is. Keep following the star. Seriously, miss, you cast me as a sheep. Come on, Mary, one final push. Ah! <gasps> He's here! <laughs> Who brought their bloody cat in? Back to school after Christmas. We've all been there. <coughs> You'll hear a noise that morning that you probably haven't heard for a while. <coughs> Shut up! You'll see teachers again that you like. Miss Smith, you're so fit. What? What? And you'll see teachers again that you don't like. First day back equals bleep test. New year, same clown. What? What? Somebody will turn up showing off all the stuff they got for Christmas. What's going on, you old flutes? You'll bump into people you haven't really missed. Happy New Year, Gary. Yeah, you too, mate. Moron. If you got set homework over Christmas and you hear something like this on your first day back. Uh, why have you not done the homework? What are you thinking? We were on a break! But you'll forget everything. How do I use a pen? You'll have one question on your mind. When's the next half term? And who else has ever made this mistake? Okay, students, can you put the date at the top of your page? Uh, Gary, it's 2024 now. Oh, bloody hell! Mum and Dad stunned after baby son's first words are all right, bruv. Oh, shut up. That's got to be a lie. <laughs> Teachers seized disco equipment from boy who hosted rave in school toilets. Let me hear you scream! Let's go! What the hell is going on in here? I'm just trying to have a shit. School bands bag so boy turns up carrying books in a microwave. Right, Stevie, pack your bag and get out. Oh, fine.
On the 12th day of Christmas, my teacher said to me, The bell doesn't dismiss you. No one's allowed on the field. I need a volunteer. It's your time that you're wasting. Stop swinging on your chair. Get rid of that chewing gum. We're gonna have a seating plan. Why do I hear talking? Because you've got ears, you massive melt. You must wear a blazer and your tie like this. Don't forget black socks. And if you broke it, put a paper towel on it. Merry Christmas, you old flutes. What is a negative number? A number which is feeling sad. What is a ratio? When you write a comment on someone's post and get more likes than that original post. What is a right angle? An angle which is never wrong. Who can find the X? No, 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 I don't want to find my X. He was a twat. Complete the following sequence. Three, five, seven, nine. Alice, you are super fine. Will you date me? No. Oh. I don't need this. <laughs> What is your favourite type of rock? The. What is the most important part of the body for playing video games? The thumb. In the human body, what is the difference between the small intestine and the large intestine? The large one is bigger. What does the human heart do? Break whenever my crush doesn't text me back. What could it mean if you can't see anything? You're looking at John Cena. Get out. Where's my seat? <laughs> Oh, I don't need this. Psst, Alice. You, me, McFlurry. Stop talking. Sorry. Yes, 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 Roadman Reese is here. Oh, I am smashing this exam. What's my name? <coughs> uh, yeah, can I have an extra piece of paper, please? Oh, grow up, Sarah. Oh, no, can I borrow a pen? Phil? Psst, Alice. <laughs> Yes, Georgia, what are you saying? I'm gonna be sick! Oh, I'm on a roll. Remember, students, you have to write in black pen. Oh, bloody hell! We want Cody. Rocky sucks. What'd you say? Okay, students, today we're going to be sharing what scares us the most. I'm scared of spiders. Gary, why are you on the toilet? Uh, why'd you think? No, I mean, oh, forget it. Next. My biggest fear is like, what if life never gets better? Don't worry, Alice, I can help with that. <laughs> uh, no, I said I want life to get better, not worse. I'm scared of what people think. We think you're a massive twat. <laughs> This coming from the road man who lives in a six bedroom house with his parents. Suck out. Uh, sorry, Gary, what's that above your head? My hair. No, there's something crawling on the wall behind you. Oh yeah, because there's a spider behind me, isn't there? No, seriously, look. Run. Ah! Oh Lord. Come on, yeah. Gary! <sighs> Okay, students, today... Oi, sir, look. I prefer Lionel Messi. Michael, what are you doing? Yeah, I'm just writing down some notes in my textbook, sir. You do know you got your camera on, don't you? Uh, okay, let's try again. Today, I... Gary, when your lesson is finished, I want you in here cleaning this bathroom. Uh, Gary, what's going on? I'm being told off by my parents. Why? Because I did a wee in my cat's litter tray. <laughs> What did you say, Dad? You should not be meeting friends. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. You can't stop me seeing my friends. Gary, do not speak to your parents like that. Oh, shut up, sir, you massive burk. <laughs> Just gonna stand there and watch me burn. Students do not burn anything. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, everyone, today is Valentine's Day. Oh, help! Oh my God, Gary, are you okay? I've fallen for you, Miss Smith, and I can't get up. <sighs> hey, yo, Sarah, I've got you a card. Is there any money inside? Uh, no. Keep it. Oh my God, someone, someone bought me a box of chocolates. <laughs> oh, shut up, Tarquin. We all know you bought them for yourself. Uh, sorry, everyone. I I've got some breaking news. Stevie has passed away. What? Huh? He owes me 20 quid. Oh, my God. Alice, just so you know, Stevie always had a big crush on you. Oh, I know. It's just a shame I never got a chance to tell him that I liked him back. Which way?
It go right foot up, left foot slide, left foot up, right foot slide. Basically, I'm saying either way we better slide. Okay, students! Today, I want everyone to say who or what they love the most. I love Alice the most. Why have you got a picture of me? I've also got you a present. Oh, that's funny because I've actually got something for you too. Really? I love strong Wi-Fi because it come to and love and... Oh, bloody hell! I love you the most, sir, because you're the best teacher ever. Thank you, Tarquin. Bruv, you got a bit of brown under your nose. I love a nice cup of tea the most. Uh, Gary, what are you doing? Making a nice cup of tea! You're doing it wrong? What do you mean? You're supposed to put the milk in first. <laughs> what did you just say, you little bit? Upper Gangnam Style. Da, 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 da. Okay, students, today we're going to be doing maths. Now I'm going back to bed. Can anyone tell me what a protractor is? Isn't that what farmers drive? What's a prime number? Is that the number you call when Amazon don't deliver? How do you... Roadman Reese, is that a vape? No. I can see you! Um, can you all stop annoying sir because I actually want to learn? Oh Tarquin, do you want to be with the top set online maths class? Yes, because that's where people like me belong. Oh, okay. Uh, press Alt and F4 and it will take you straight there. Alt F4. <laughs> <laughs> you suck. It's my birthday, you old flutes. So let's go down memory lane and see what I was like at school. This is me in year four, this is me in year six, and this is me in year nine with the worst haircut ever seen. On my last day at my school, they surprised me by putting together a compilation of some of the things I got up to. Roll VT. Join me, join me, Sandy. I'm stealing no. Yeah, I'm stealing no. Stevie knows it. Stevie knows. Stevie knows. And you all want those bottles of donuts. Isn't that right, guys? As you can see, they even made me cry. <laughs> but I'll finish this video with something I said back then, and I mean it to you even more now. British public will be called up to fight if UK goes to war because military is too small. Are you ready to fight? Yeah, boy! There's no games here, Sam. That's okay, we can go old school and play hide and seek. Are you trying to be clever? I've been called many things in my life, but clever isn't one of them. Are you answering back? Well, yes, that's how a conversation works. Just for that, I want you to count to ten. <laughs> All right, one, two. Who taught you how to count? Miss Smith, she was so fit. Here we start from zero. I don't know if that's true. Oh, you don't even know how to get a haircut. Well, that's not very nice. Get down and give me 20. I haven't got any cash, but do you take card? Get out. <laughs> Baby, calm down. Calm down. Yes, students, calm down. Oi, sir, look. That's very nice, Stevie, but... Do you want to see who else I printed off? We haven't got time for... Okay, one sec. Oh, for goodness sake. I prefer Roman Reigns. Roadman Reese, are you gaming? No. So why are you holding a PlayStation controller? I I'm using it to scratch my back because I've got a rash from an allergic reaction having to listen to your rubbish. Uh, why are we doing online school again? Because Gary has locked all the doors at school and won't give us the keys. <laughs> Gary, I want the keys back. But why? Gary? Mog ate them, listen. <laughs> Gary? <laughs> Gary? <laughs> Gary! will ban disposable vapes. Ah, uh, sorry mate, you said you can't do that anymore. We'll stop children getting hold of vaping alternatives. Put the cigar down. <sighs> we'll help protect the health of our children for the future. Yeah, but you could say chocolate is bad for children's health too. We'll ban their sale to children too. Bloody hell, it sucks to be you right now. 
Bruh. These plans, alongside our commitment to create the first smoke-free generation. I think you should focus on making this generation the first generation to not have to beg to go to the toilet at school. Nobody wants to see their child smoking or vaping. Mystic Mog, no. What? Let's do a little quiz. Where are Arsenal right now in the Premier League? Third. Where are Man City? Second. And where are Liverpool? First. Ah! Thirteen is too young to make life-changing GCSE subject choices, says Ofsted boss. Oh, do you remember picking those four GCSE options? Oh, hell. Let me know in the comments below which subjects you picked for your GCSEs. Personally, I wasn't very academic. I like the creative subjects. And I wanted three of my choices to be media, music tech, and drama. I didn't want to do dance, though, because I cut worse shapes than Drake did in Hotline Bling. So I said to the head of my sixth form, I want to be a cross between Steven Spielberg, David Guetta, and Will Smith. He was like, Well, you can only be one of them, so pick one creative subject and get out of my office. I was like, all right, calm down, you miserable cow. So I picked media. One down, three to go. I like football, so I picked PE, and I made sure I was ill whenever we had to do rugby or cross country. I picked business because I like Dragon's Den, The Apprentice, and my crush was picking it too. Daphne? And lastly, I didn't know what to pick, so I wrote down seven subjects that we were allowed to do, put them all in a little jar, and randomly picked one out. And, uh, what did it end up being? Sociology. <laughs> Hello. Bonjour. Ah, oh, you speak Spanish. Uh, French. Uh, oh yeah, of course it is. J'aime tes cheveux. Does that mean you think my hair looks great? We oui. Finally, someone who appreciates fantastic hair. Hello? Download a czar. Huh? Download a czar now. What's that? It's a social video chat app. Okay. It basically allows you to connect with new people all over the world. Is Zendaya on there? I don't know, but someone did just compliment my hair. Blimey, so anything really is possible. <laughs> Wait, what? So hang on, what do I do? Download a czar. It's fun, you'll interact with new people, and you can finally speak to someone who isn't your cat. A few moments later. You support Liverpool? Me too! My cat is literally called a czar. You remind me of a cross between Cristiano Ronaldo and The Rock. Best app ever. <laughs> I got caught looking at the clock. Detention. I hit the fire alarm in the maths block. Detention. I forged my mom's signature in my diary. Detention. I started playing music in the library. Quiet! I left my lanyard at home. Detention. I sent Sarah a picture from Google Chrome. <laughs> Detention. I moved seats even though we had a seating plan. Detention. I came to school with a fake tan. One of the biggest issues children. Oh, come on, mate, turn your phone off. One of the biggest issues children and teachers grapple with every day is how to refrain from swearing at each other. Is the imp. Oh, at least put it on silent. Is the impact of. Stop it! Oh. See how frustrating that is. Well, yeah, you just threw your phone on the floor and broke it. Almost one third of secondary school pupils have gone through the process of having to beg to go to the toilet. Said their lessons were disrupted by phone. What about chewing gum? We know that they're a distraction in the classroom. What about wearing white socks? Many schools have already banned them. Blimey. Which has led to a safer and better learning environment for their students. I have only one thing to say to that. Why life on? And you're gonna hear me roar! H Hello students. Who in the blue hell are you? I'm your sub teacher today, Mr. Bacon. <laughs> So Stevie, where are you taking me for our first date? I thought we'd kick things off by going for a cheeky McFlurry. Uh, I don't really like McFlurries though. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it. Uh, okay, everybody, I'm just gonna take the register. Oh, this should be good. Niamha. It's pronounced Neve. Lewis. Yo, bro, it's Louis. Isla. Um, it's Isla. A.A. Laya. Alia. Michael A. It's Michaela. So this must be Mikhail. Michael! Uh-oh. Liverpool. Liverpool. Oh, shut up. Okay, students, did you all have a good half term? Me and Alice had our first date. Oh, how did it go? Uh Who's your favourite celebrity? Oh, it's gotta be The Rock. Oh, I don't like him. What? I won a trophy. For what? Being the world's biggest melt. I wrote a song. Go on then, sing it. I said, do you wanna be my girlfriend, please? I came to school with a slice of cheese.
Um, okay. Miss Smith, you know you're my favourite. Gary, get off your phone. But why? And I hope you've done the homework I set. No. Gary. Okay, so how about this? If I can't hit this camera with a ball, you can suspend me. School days without Gary sounds pretty good. But if I do hit the camera with a ball, you have to dress up as Spider-Man for our next lesson. Oh, hang on. <laughs> uh, no, it's not that, it's... <laughs> All right, sod it, let's do it. <laughs> oh, sh <laughs> Hello, students. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you actually did it! Oh, I'm not in the mood, so today we're going to be doing... Uh, hang on, sir. Guys, who do you think is the best superhero of all time? Oh, he's got to be Batman. No, he's got no real powers! Don't you dare diss Batman. All right, he's big, strong and rich. He's basically the rock with hair. For me, it's Catwoman. Yes, Alice. My favourite is Aquaman. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense because your best friend is your pet goldfish. Iron Man is the best. Why, Sarah? Because he's fit and got loads of money. Bit like me, then. <coughs> Sir, who is your favourite superhero? It's actually Spider-Man. Oh, is it? And people often say I am very similar to the wall crawler. The only thing that crawls around here is my skin whenever I hear your voice. Oh, wow. Oh, here he comes. I need to speak to you all this evening. This is what our head teacher used to say before we got told off in a school assembly. We are a country where we love our neighbours. Turn that bloody music down! No country is perfect. Yeah, but you wait until I create Stevie Land. When they tell their lies, we will tell the truth. <laughs> Oh, mate, you know when you get a phone call from an unknown number? What should we do? We should reject it and reject it again. Done. Oi, students don't still have to underline the date and title in their books, do they? We must draw a line. Sorry, guys, I tried. What's the best thing about London? Big Ben. What do you think of people who leave you on red in a WhatsApp group? No respect. What is the name of the main character in Family Guy? Nick Griffin. Oh, it's Peter Griffin, but you were half right. I'm thinking of telling Zendaya how I feel about her. We will back you. Do you think I'll end up marrying Zendaya? Yes. Yeah! But no. Oh. And yes. Yeah! But no. Oh, go away. Happy birthday to me, Gary. Happy birthday to me, Gary. Happy birthday, dear, Gary. Exactly. Happy birthday to me, Gary! <sighs> Students, your behaviour recently has been diabolical. What does that word mean? Atrocious. Huh? Bad. Oh, yeah. Oi, what's everyone's star sign? Uh, Michael, we're not doing this. I'm an Aquarius. I'm a Taurus. Aren't there the two star signs that hate each other? What? What? I love stirring. <sighs> okay, so today, I don't believe in all that Zodiac rubbish. Well, I share a birthday with Ryan Gosling and we we're very similar. <laughs> <laughs> All right, has everyone done the hu I'm a Leo. I'm a Virgo. I'm a Libra. That's enough! Oh, bloody hell. All right, sir, what are you? I am a Pisces. Pisces? I thought you were a vegan. <sighs> Oh, Liverpool should have won yesterday. Nah, bruv, City were the better team. What'd you say? Come on in. Okay. Today, I want... Why are all our fire alarms going off at the same time? Michael, I'm sure it's fine, but I need everyone to stay calm. <coughs> oh my God. Gary, just relax. How can I relax when the country's on fire? Gary, the country is not on... <coughs> oh, the country is on fire and I've just saved Alice from a burning building. Um, what? Stevie, get off your phone and stop lying. Nah, I'm out. It's every student for themselves. Tarquin, get back here now. Hey, yo, Sarah, there's more fire here than when you're in the room. Roadman Reese, get off your phone and stop flirting. Oh, that's absolute absolute scene scene here. here. If I see one more person on their phone, I'm gonna. Hello, 999. We need a helicopter with a massive bucket of water attached to it, like in one of those cartoons. Gary, stop wasting their time. <coughs> Gary, don't panic. What else is there to do? I don't get paid enough for this job. Happy birthday to me, Gary. Happy birthday to me, Gary. Happy birthday, dear, Gary. Exactly. Happy birthday to me, Gary! <sighs> Students, your behaviour recently has been diabolical. What does that word mean? Atrocious. Huh? Bad. Oh, yeah. Oi, what's everyone's star sign? Uh, Michael, we're not doing this. I'm an Aquarius. I'm a Taurus. Aren't there the two star signs that hate each other? What? What? I love stirring. <sighs> okay, so today, I don't believe in all that Zodiac rubbish. Well, I share a birthday with Ryan Gosling and we're very similar. <laughs>
All right, has everyone done the I'm a Leo. I'm a Virgo. I'm a Libra. That's enough! Oh, bloody hell. All right, sir, what are you? I am a Pisces. Pisces? I thought you were a vegan. <laughs> Oh, Liverpool should have won yesterday. Nah, bruv, City were the better team. What'd you say? Go on in. Okay. Today, I want... Why are all our fire alarms going off at the same time? Michael, I'm sure it's fine, but I need everyone to stay calm. <coughs> oh my God. Gary, just relax. How can I relax when the country's on fire? Gary, the country is not on... <coughs> Oh, the country is on fire and I've just saved Alice from a burning building. Um, what? Stevie, get off your phone and stop lying. Nah, I'm out. It's every student for themselves. Tarquin, get back here now. Hey, yo, Sarah, there's more fire here than when you're in the room. Roadman Reese, get off your phone and stop flirting. Oh, oh it's absolutely absolute scenes scenes here. here. If I see one more person on their phone, I'm gonna... Hello, 999. We need a helicopter with a massive bucket of water attached to it like in one of those cartoons. Gary, stop wasting their time. <laughs> Gary, don't panic. What else is there to do? I don't get paid enough for this job. Five, six, seven, eight. What are you doing? This in prison. Woo! Make school fun. Woo! Stop, stop whinging about my shirt, my tie, and my shoes. Students, if you don't stop, I'm gonna so stop quit your crying. crying. Woo! About, about chewing gum. Woo! And using my phone, my earphones, and wearing white socks. No, that's it, I've had enough! You like my dog, the Meowza, don't you? Are you sure that's not a cat? N no, it's a Meowza, the best dog in the world. Do you need glasses? Listen, it's the only dog breed in the world that doesn't need to be walked, bathes itself, never barks, and is happy to be left at home on its own. I swear you've just described a cat. Don't disrespect the Meowza like that. Okay, so where can I get one? You can adopt one from a local shelter to you. Can I just have that one? If you try and touch the Meowza one more time, I'm gonna rip that thing you call hair off the top of your head. Prime Minister, empty your lunchbox. Are they highlighters? No. They're vapes, aren't they? Yeah. How many flavours have you got? Grapefruit. What? Bubblegum. <gasps> strawberry. Huh? Berry burst. You are not setting a good example. When you look at that, what's the first thing that jumps out? Detention. Now get out. <laughs> Good evening. Hello, Boris, you old flute. The coronavirus is the biggest threat this country has faced for decades. Oh, I'm not sure that's true. You're forgetting that baby shark song. You should not be going shopping except for essentials like food and medicine. And use food delivery services. Hey, yo, Domino's, can I have an extra large pepperoni and put it on Boris's tab? You should not be meeting friends. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, say that again. You should not be meeting friends. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. <laughs> it's the way you say it. You should say no. <laughs> Boris, repeat that. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. Don't worry, Boris. I don't have any friends. <laughs> We have a very special guest today. Is it Beyonce? Is it Taylor Swift? Is it my dad, Boris? If you shut up for one minute, I'll tell you. Please welcome Stevie Nose. Shall I go? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And here we go. There is one man that knows the old flutes, and it's Stevie. They do not call me the pupils champion for nothing. Ah, I see what you did there. Exam season is fast approaching. What? And Stevie knows there are many distractions nowadays. Huh? Stevie knows there's a temptation of gaming. Oh, come on! Stevie knows there's a temptation of social media. <laughs> Stevie knows, if you're 18, there is a temptation of having the odd cheeky alcoholic beverage. The only thing I drink is breast milk. But you've got to get the balance right. Oh, bloody hell! So your essays, write them. Your books, read them. Your revision, do it. I'm feeling pumped up because success can be yours, but it damn sure ain't coming for free. You know what you gotta do. I'm gonna get all ones. Gary, the top grade is nine. But why? But on the other hand, Stevie doesn't want you letting anyone put any extra pressure on you. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm panicking. Because you as young people have enough pressure to be dealing with nowadays. Yeah, but I don't wanna let my parents and teachers down. This is not about anyone else. This is about you. That is true, I am very important. So don't let people like Mr. McIroncock stress you out. <sighs> Left the oven on. 
prepare right, do your absolute best, and whatever happens, everything will be okay. I acknowledge the pupil's champion. Because who knows? Gary knows. Ah, hey yo, breast milk Gary, be quiet. Stevie knows. Mmm, <sighs> not bad. It's the final countdown. Do -do -do -do. Gary. Do -do -do -do. Gary. Do -do -do -do. Gary! Alright, alright, sorry sir, I'm just excited about breaking up for Easter. I know you are, but where are the keys? What, the keys to my house? No. What, the keys to my Bugatti? No. What, the keys to Buckingham Palace? No. Wait, what? What? Where are the school keys? I don't know. We can't keep doing online school. But why? Because exam season is fast approaching and you can't do them at home. But why? Because people like you will cheat. Oh wow, the only person cheating around here is Alice on Stevie. What? 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 Please just tell me where are the keys? What's everyone's favourite egg? Uh, Michael, no. Boiled. Scrambled. Fried. No, I meant chocolate Easter eggs, you clowns. Um, students, we are not doing this. Mine is mini eggs. Dairy milk buttons. Freddo. Dairy milk caramel. Mine is this one. Gary, that's an Easter egg for a cat. What? Look! <laughs> right, that is it. You're all doing online school over Easter. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah! Students, this is not funny. <laughs> How do I turn this setting off? Press Alt and F4. Alt F4. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. I know it's April Fool's Day, but we haven't got time for pranks. All right, sir, just relax and have a sip of your tea. Good idea. <laughs> oh, who put salt in my tea? Bogies, bogies, bogies! Stop it! <laughs> Where is Stevie? Why is there a cat on screen? Hey yo, show some respect, that's Mystic Mog. Where's Gary? <sighs> Gary, wake up! Hey yo, we've still got an hour until school starts. No, the clocks went forward this weekend. Oh bloody hell! Okay students, I don't think you're taking this very seriously. Ah! Have you all done the assignment I set you? Michael, your breakfast is ready. Okay sir, I've just sent you the link to it now. Thank you Gary. Five, six, seven, eight. Don't you dare start singing. I'm Jim Gary, yes, I'm the big Gary. All you other Jim Garys are just ordinary. So won't the real Jim Gary do a press up, do a sit up, do a pull up? Okay, one, I said no singing. Mm, technically that was rapping. And two, Gary, why are you wearing gym gear and not school uniform? Cause I'm Jim Gary, yes, I'm the big Gary. All you other Jim Garys are just ordinary. So won't the real Jim Gary do a press up, do a sit up, do a pull up. <laughs> I woke up in Jim Gary's body. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, students, you are not here to have fun. Yeah, we know this place is basically a prison. Excuse me? Bruv, it's literally the Easter holidays and you're still making us do online school. That's because your behavior recently has been worse than Gary's hair. What'd you say? And Gary, I'm going to be setting homework over the weekend. Oh, and sir, I'm not going to be doing it. You are. I'm not. You are. I'm not. Oh, for f Why not? Well, firstly, it's WrestleMania weekend. Wrestle what? And secondly, it's Man United versus Liverpool. Yeah, no, did. Come on, Liverpool. Gary, you're really starting to me off. Oh. Okay, sir, I challenge you. To what? To an arm wrestling match. No, we're not doing that. Gary versus Mr. McIroncock. Oh! Listen, if I beat you, you have to resign. Uh, hang on, I've got a mortgage to pay. Yeah, but if you beat me, I'll leave this school and you'll never see me again. <gasps> no more Gary. No more Gary. You're on. Welcome to WrestleMania! Should schools have uniforms? Yes or no? Do you want to know what I think? What? I said, I said let's get, get rid of uniform, especially when it gets warm, because we need a little personality, and we're not going to get that wearing these. I said, let's, let's get, get rid of uniform, especially when it gets warm, because we need a little personality, and we're not going to get that wearing these. Uh, students. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. la. La 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 la.
Give up! No, you give up! Fight, fight, fight! But how have you all got inside my house? Remember, whoever loses this arm wrestling match has to leave school. Your mum's so old, she went to school with Jesus. Oh! Oh, Gary, you're thicker than Kim Kardashian's bum. Oh! I've got £10 on Gary. Nah, Sarah's gonna win. Gary couldn't beat an egg. What'd you say? Stevie, why don't you fight for me like this anymore? Alice, you're doing my head in. What? What? Sir, your teeth are so yellow, traffic slows down when you smile. Oh! Gary, you're so dumb, you returned a tube of polos to the shop because they had a hole in them. Oh! Oh, the end is near, Gary. No. Say goodbye, Gary. No! Goodbye, Gary. Ah! Where's Sir? Oh. <laughs> Who did that? I'm not sure, but I'm taking his toaster. supermarket that I go into <laughs> for a split second I thought have you somehow caught The Rock or Zendaya? Everything that I love, The Rock, Zendaya, Liverpool, WKD, Mystic Rock, Flowrider, Flowrider Wild Ones which should be the national anthem. <laughs> I mean I don't think it's anything else. This is the best day of your life. Mate this tops everything I've ever done. There's one thing that's missing. <laughs> is that <laughs> that that's oh my god. Another gift for you. Get on it. <laughs> Me and my future wife. That's VIP <laughs> experience. Stevie knows. <laughs> <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. When did you learn to count? I was in maths, ratio, proportions, fractions, and equations. Don't, Don't forget graphs. I'm in set five, but I was in set one. So pipe down, please, sir, because I am so dumb. dumb. I swear, if you carry on, I'm gonna. You can find me in maths, ratio, proportions, fractions, and equations. Don't, Don't forget graphs. I'm in set five, but I was in set one. So pipe down, please, sir, because I am so dumb. <laughs> Why are you always in the mood? Oh, tune! When did that come out again? 2020. Time is moving way too fast. Okay, students, today is careers day. What is your dream job? Oh, Miss Smith, I don't think I'll get a job because I've got a weakness. What weakness, Gary? Those beautiful brown eyes of yours. <sighs> I want to be a professional footballer. You ain't got the skills for that. Babe, listen, we could be the new Posh and Bex. Oh. I want to be an artist. Oh, do you have any drawings to show the class? This is Kim Kardashian. Okay. I want to be a rapper. Mate, you can't even rap Christmas presents. I want to be a vet. Oh, lovely. Do you have any pets? Nah, I don't really like animals. I want to be a politician. Yeah, I can see that happening. Really? Yeah, they talk sh** just like you do. I want to be who I've always wanted to be. And who's that, Gary? Spider-Man. Five, six, seven, eight. Uh, don't start singing. Sir said no chewing gum, knee lemp skirt. You better come to school wearing a fresh white shirt. No headphones, get off your bloody phone. Stop coming to school wearing so much damn cologne. No coats inside, stop vaping outside You're gonna get attention if you don't start wearing your tie Use a black pen, not a blue This class is like a zoo You can't go to the toilet even if you need a poo Now nah, I'm done. Alt F4 Welcome back to school. <sighs> Gary finally gave us back the keys to the building. My mum kicked me out, so I needed somewhere to be. And today, Mr. McIroncock. I'm back, m****. 
But why? I want Gary suspended. But why? Does everyone else want that too? Yes! No! Suspend him! Hey, yo, Sarah, why are you piping up? Because I've had a crush on you for like five years and you've never asked me out? That's because I've only got eyes for Miss Smith. Hey, yo, it's Mr. Nipple! My name is Mr. Nipple! <laughs> suspend him! Does anyone else want to speak up? Oh, Mr. Elements! Gary is affecting the other students. No, he's not, you melt. Sir? He distracts you all. Sir? He talks too much. Sir? And his hair annoys me. Sir? What is it, Gary? You know those mad science experiments you taught us? Yes. I was doing one in here on my own earlier. Right. What would happen if I now did this? Gary, no! <laughs> Welcome back to online school. Why are we doing this again? Because you blew up the school. <laughs> <laughs> Exams are fast approaching. How is your revision going? Um, it's not. I'm gonna send an AI version of me to each exam. Whatever happens, I know I've got Alice. Um... What? What? When you're as beautiful as me, you don't need to worry about exams. I have been revising since last October. Yeah, that's why I egged your house on Halloween. That was you! Oh my god. Uh, Gary, what about you? I revise everywhere. What do you mean? On the football pitch, in the gym, Gym. On the toilet. Gary revises everywhere. Gary, that is fantastic. You're gonna smash Key Stage 4. Key Stage 4? I've been revising Key Stage 1. Uh, Gary, that's for students aged between 5 and 7. This year is going by way too fast. North London is red! I lost my goldfish. Okay, students, today is World Wish Day. I wish you would get a job somewhere else. What? What? If you all had one wish, what would it be? Marry Zendaya. Excuse me? To pass my exams. Mate, you need a miracle, not a wish. I would wish for more wishes. Ah, oh, there's always one, isn't there? I just want to get some beauty sleep. Yeah, you need it. Bish what? To be a D&B producer. D&B for you must stand for douchebag. A or what? To get my life together. To stop overthinking. To win the lottery! Okay, and what would you do with the money? Buy this school and sack you. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Is that what the midwife said to your mum when you were born? <laughs> How are you feeling about your upcoming exams? I want to pass my GCSEs, my A-levels and SATs too. Da, da, da. To get good grades is my main goal. Revision is my issue. Da, da, da. But I will revise every day, morning to night. Da, da, da. Hoping I won't zone out too much and things will stay in my head. Uh, students, my exams, gonna pass them all. Uh, excuse me. I know it's it's gonna be hard, my exams, oh, it's gonna suck more than a Dyson Hoover. My exams, gonna pass them all. Okay, that's enough. I don't wanna have to retake an A or B or a 9 or 8. That would be great. Gonna pass them all, gonna pass them all. My exams, you're all deluded. Which way? 2024 is going by way too fast 2019 feels like it's in the distant past So now I'm sat here wondering what's going on Because something's fishy Time is moving too quickly So much has happened in the last four years No wonder we're all on the brink of crying tears Covid and lockdowns and free PMs Bloody hell! I've realised whilst drinking my tea Time is moving too quickly Oh, oh, oh Time is moving too quickly Oh, oh, oh Time is moving too quickly I just want to go back Everybody, Everybody wants to steal, steal my, my girl. girl. Enough! Ooh. Today, I want you to argue for or against mobile phones being banned in schools. Ban them. All right, Tarquin, why? Because they distract us when we should be focused on amazing lessons taught by you. It's quite a good point. Hey, yo, Tarquin, you're just mad we filmed you kissing that pigeon. I think mobile phones should be allowed in schools. Do you want to expand on that? No. Okay. I think they're good for when we want to take photos of the notes on the board. You could just write the notes down. What year are we in? 1972? I think phones should be banned in schools. Why? Because cheaters like Stevie are probably messaging Zendaya. Alice, I told you, you're my number one. Gary. Gary. 
Gary! What? Are you for phones? Why would I need four phones? No, are you for or against mobile phones in schools? We have to keep phones because what if I got kidnapped after school? Trust me, five minutes with you and the kidnappers would give you back. Oh, you mother <laughs> Okay. I've got plenty of time. Exams are ages away. I'll be fine. Hey, yo, Roadman Reese, have you started revising yet? Yeah. Oh, you snake. Come on, Gary. All you've got to do is answer a few questions by remembering some information. I can remember the lyrics to literally hundreds of songs. I've got this. I haven't got this. I've got 24 exams. That's like an exam every day for one whole month. Now, wait a minute, that's not right, is it? Okay, safe to say I'm not gonna pass maths. What kind of psychopath invented exams? Exams were invented by American businessman Henry Fischel. What a twat. What if I fail when the only food I can afford in the future is baked beans? Pi R squared sounds like air. Oh, I can't be bothered. Your first exam starts now. Ah! Give me a thumbs up if you can hear me, please. Right, Gary, from now on, we're gonna ignore you. Yeah, all right, sir, good luck with that. Okay, students, should schools have uniform? No, especially as we're having to do online school. Da, 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 da. I don't think school uniform lets me show off my personality. Yeah, that's a good thing you're two-faced, Freddo. <laughs> Ah? Yes, because we need to get ready for work in the real world. The only place that is going to hire you is some kind of vacuum cleaning company. Why? Because all you do is suck up! Oh my god, I love Miss Smith so much. I don't mind uniform, but can we get rid of these clip-on ties? The only reason we have clip-on ties is because you're too stupid to do a proper tie. This way? England! Gary, stop that! But why? And you can stop that too! I thought you said you were gonna ignore me! Yes, but it's pretty hard to when you've got Mr Bean's face behind you! Hello! Your exam starts now. Can I borrow a pen? Oh Gary, you must have a pen somewhere. Okay, let me go look. Give me strength! Uh, Roadman Reese, you cannot listen to music whilst doing your exam. Oh yeah, because Eminem is gonna rap the answers to me, isn't he? I found a pen, sir. That's not a black pen. So? It has to be a black pen. Oh, bloody hell! Oh, my stomach hurts. Oh, mine too. Shh, I don't feel very well. Same. These are exam conditions. I'm gonna be sick! Oh, it looks like I'm gonna need an extra piece of paper. Oh, grow up. Kumbaya, my lord. Okay, firstly, your bottle needs to be totally clear. Done. And secondly, you can only drink water. It is water, it's just my pipes are dirty. A few hours later. What did you all put for question two? Because I put 26. 28. 25. 27. Gary, what did you put? I put Jamaica. Campiones! Oh, I don't need this. I'll always love you, Jurgen Klopp. Ah, uh, this is an exam. Stop talking about football and be quiet. Don't you like football, sir? No, I prefer hobbies such as tea drinking. Yeah, because you're a mug. Alice, is that you? I haven't eaten in 24 hours. Why? Because I've been too nervous for this stupid exam! Okay, calm. <laughs> Gary, get off your phone! I'm using it as a calculator! This is an English exam. What? Done! Now, do you know what? Where's he going? <laughs> oh, oh. Gary, stop swinging on your chair! But why? Because you're gonna hurt yourself! But why? Gary, I said stop swinging on your chair! But why? Stop eating during my lesson. Oh. Five, six, seven, eight. Don't you dare. You banned our head, phones, mobile phones, British Bulldog. And I got a detention for wearing rings and they are socks. And you threw a hissy fit because my diary wasn't signed. Because you never stop complaining. You never stop complaining. I needed a wee but. You wouldn't let me, and I got a detention for dyeing my hair. And when I wear fake tan, bat man, you lose your damn mind. Cause you never stop complaining. You never stop complaining. I'm calling all your parents. Oh bloody hell! Bonjour students! Hello Mr Nipple! Gary, my name is Mr Nipple. Omelette du fromage! Oh god. Okay class, what does this mean? Je m'appelle Mr Nipple, j'habite à Paris. You really like apples and nipples in Paris? 
All right, let's try a more simple one. Je suis anglais. You really like angles? Oh my God. Quelle est la date de ton anniversaire? Uh, let's count in French. Un, deux, trois, quatre. Engolo, engolo, cante. Gary, can you stop saying random French words and names? Mais pourquoi? Right, Gary, if you carry on, I'm going to give you a red card. Oh, pour ton don fait. Roadman Reese, can you introduce yourself in French, please? Hey, yo, Roadman Reese can barely speak English, so how is he going to speak French? Bruv, you're a waste. We oui, sir. Uh, Gary, I must say, even though you are very annoying, your French is very good. No, we oui, sir. Oh, fantastic! Throwing a no in there as well. Sir, I need to we. Oui. The last day of school. Lessons turn into photo shoots for social media. If there was a teacher that you liked, you might bring him a card, maybe some chocolates. But if there was a teacher that you didn't like, sir, yes, Roadman Reese, you suck. It's all about signing each other's shirts. Girls will leave cute messages like, good luck in your exams, babe. Whilst the boys do this, let's draw a massive penis. Does your school have a leavers assembly? I'm talking singing, dancing, weirdness. I'm gonna drink this bottle of vinegar in under a minute. <laughs> But once that day is over, there are two types of people. And... We did it! We did it! Yeah! Make some noise! What the hell do you think you're doing? Michael? Jason, stop it. Stevie and Alice, behave yourselves. Sarah, that's enough. Tarquin, I expected better from you. Roadman Reese, I expected nothing less from you. I don't even know who you are. Gary, stop playing that music. You have no power here. Right, all of you except Gary, go home now and you're all getting a yellow card. Aww. Mm. You suck. And Gary. Yes, sir. You're not getting a yellow card. Ha <laughs> yeah, because I'm the man. You're getting a red card and you know what that means. What? You're not suspended, you're expelled. <gasps> no! Sir, have you seen this? Yes, and he's still not coming back. Hashtag we want Gary is trending worldwide. I don't care. Even celebrities are getting involved now. What? Ah, oh, man, I'd slap the head off him, but he's a very nice guy. He's a beast. Have you ever thought about kissing him? Thought about a lot of things. Students, Gary is gone. I'm not doing any work until you bring Gary back. Same. Me too. Yeah. If I'm honest, I hate you all equally. I will always work for you, sir. Oh, he's so annoying. But why? Don't start. All right, fine. I'm going to set him a challenge, and if he does it, he can come back. Yeah, but where is he? Uh Gary, you're not old enough to drive. It's fine, I've been playing GTA since I was five. Do you want to come back to school? No. But I have a challenge for you. Oh, I like challenges. If you can throw a paper ball into a bin, I'll let you come back. Let's do this. A few moments later. Five, six, seven, eight. No. Hey, hey miss, if I like you. Stop it. I have for a long time. That's enough. To me, you're worth more. Please. Than a bottle of red prime. Aren't they like a pound now? And you've been my crush. Ah. Since I was in year eight. So what'd you say, miss? Ah. Let's go on a date. Pizza Hut, Nando's, Wagamama, or KFC. Just pick one of these and I will take you there. Pizza Hut, Nando's, Wagamama, or KFC. Or what? about Mackie's? Just marry me, please. I'm calling the police. Oh, hell no! Exams should be banned. Do you want to expand on that? No. <clears throat> okay, uh, who wants to go next? Whatever you do, don't get eye contact with him. Uh, Roadman Reese. Oh, suck out! What was that? No, no, nothing. I, I just sneezed. Okay, good. Should exams be banned? Well, um, I think, um... Hey, yo, speak up! We can't hear you over here! Well, you definitely heard me last night when I was kissing your mum! <laughs> okay, Roadman Reese, sit down. Uh, Alice, you're up. Alright, so I think exams should be banned because, um, because, um... <laughs> can't do this. Oh look, does anyone have a valid reason why exams should be banned? Well yeah, they're just memory tests and I can't even remember my own mum's birthday. It's today, by the way. 
Oh, bloody hell. Right, Tarquin, you're next to make it quick. Guys, sometimes it's not always about trying to fix something that's broken. Sometimes it's about starting over and creating something better. Yeah, that's why you've got a younger brother. Ah! <laughs> Mom! Everywhere we go! Everywhere we go! Uh, students, today you are representing the school. I think I'm gonna be sick. Don't you dare. <laughs> Oh, it smells worse than my nan's armpit. Oh, it's going to be a long day. A few hours later. Okay, students, have fun, but behave. Ah! Two hours later. Oh, look, it's Gary and the other morons from the Stevie Knows Academy. Oh, it's Barry and the rest of Team Twat from the Mystic Mog Academy. Our school are running this place today. No offence, mate, but you lot couldn't run a bath. Gary, what's it like knowing you'll never get a girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> Funny thing is, the only woman you've ever kissed is your mum. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors. Chicken, donuts, carrots. What? Oh, sorry, I thought we were just saying random words. The loser has to go on the roller coaster on their own. Rock, paper, scissors. What? What? I've won! The rock would batter a piece of paper. No, it's not the rock, it's a rock. Uh, no, his name is definitely the rock. No, I mean, in the game, it's just a rock, it's not the rock. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> Uh, why have you all got the same answers? Because we all had the same questions! Ah! <laughs> okay class, what is the one thing that should be taught in schools but isn't? We should be taught self-defense like this. How to maintain healthy relationships. Hey yo, Alice, what is that supposed to mean? It means a bowl of cereal is not what I call a dinner date. Hey yo, Stevie, I love cereal. Ish, what? I think basic first aid like mouth to mouth. Bruv, you just want an excuse to kiss someone you melt. I think great dance moves like these need to be taught. Oh, Gary, you give me such a headache, I think I've got a concussion. Sir, do you know how I know you haven't got a concussion? How? Because to have a concussion, you have to have a brain! <laughs> <laughs> Who is Gary? Five, six, seven, eight. What's happening? Hate school ties, loves mince pies, he's a Gemini, salutes magpies, says but why? Eats cereal straight out the box, but you're never gonna catch him. Sweet selling on the damn school bus, it's a full head rush. Like Lionel Messi, killing and back, he's bigger and stronger and faster and dumber and he's... Gary, Gary, Jim Gary. I like protein. He's banned from the school library. I like chicken. Gary, Gary, Jim Gary. I like donuts. He is allergic to dairy. Oh bloody hell. Your exam starts now. Oh, this is easy. Oh, I'm on fire. This is going surprisingly well. Gary, how are you getting on? I've spelt my name wrong. Roadman Reese, get off your phone. I'm not on it. I can see you. Question one is B. Uh, Stevie, are you cheating? Yeah, he's cheating on Alice with me. What? 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 Many unbearable hours later. You have five minutes left. <coughs> five minutes later. Please put down your pens. Gary, how do you think it went? It was a tough start, but I think I've smashed this. Well done, Gary. I've always known deep down you were very good at science. Science? Yes. I thought this was an English exam. No. Oh, bloody hell! Mystic Mog is back. Euro 2024. England. Serbia. Mystic Mog, go! Right, come on, we need a good start. Oh, slap me with bread and call me a sandwich. It's England! One down, six to go. Da -da -da. It's coming home. Uh, Gary? It's coming home. Gary? It's coming! Gary! Ha! Okay, students, what job do you want to do in the future? I want to be a computer hacker. Gary, I don't think you have the brain capacity to do that. Oh, you're going to pay for that comment. I want to be a garlic bread expert. A what? I want to be a meme historian. Eh? I want to be a McFlurry scientist. Huh? I want to be a really good teacher like you, sir. Ah. I want to be an emoji translator. Are you all trolling me? I want to be a footballer's wife. I want to be a third choice goalkeeper for a football team. As long as you earn at least 50 grand a week, I'll marry you. Damn. That's enough! Uh, Gary, what are you up to? Sir, I've just hacked your computer. What? I've just seen your browser history. What? And I've got only one thing to say. Ugh.
His mind is racing, heartbeat can't stop pacing. He had a bowl of wheat for brekkie, prefer a shreddy. Uh, students, this is your final exam. Oh, I can't be bothered. Gary, I do not like lazy people. Why? We literally didn't do anything. Okay, students, I'm just popping out for a moment. I want total silence whilst I'm gone. Okay, sir, so love you. What has everyone put for question one? A, B, C, it's easy as one, two, three. You see, Gary, this is why you keep failing at life. Uh, if I was failing at life, I wouldn't be able to do this, would I? Gary, sit down. Oh, you mother. One hour later. Just looking through some of your answers now. What did you all put for that last question? What question was that again? Which country won the gold medal for the men's 100 meter sprint at the 2012 Olympics? Ah, USA. 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 Gary, what did you put? I put Jamaica. <laughs> well, the good news is, Gary, finally, the correct answer is Jamaica. This is why they call me Gary the Goat. The bad news is that's the only question you've got right and you failed the exam. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. We recently hit 100,000 of you old flutes on YouTube and they sent me this. And what did Mystic Mog do when the box came? Oh. When I first started making videos, I wanted to do two things. One, entertain people. And two, help young people with the issues they're facing. And I really hope I've been able to do that because whether you know it or not, so many of you have kept me going during times when I didn't really want to be here anymore. Whether it was during lockdown or when my dad passed, your support has meant more than you'll ever know. So thank you for sharing, liking, commenting on the videos, and most importantly, being on my team. And to celebrate, I think it's time I did something like this again. It's finally over! Um, students, can you hear me okay? No! Right, Gary, I'm gonna mute you for the rest of the lesson. Okay, students, should the school day start later? Yeah, it should start at 10 past three. Yeah, but Michael, our school day finishes at quarter past three. Exactly. I think the school day should start even earlier. Okay, Tarquin, why? Because that would mean more time being taught by you. Oh, f off. Keep the same times, but make the school week four days, not five. Ugh, you just want another day to cheat on me with Sarah. Alice, I'm not cheating on you. Hey, yo, Stevie, do you want a cup of tea? Oh, fuck it. Gary, do you think you're more important than everyone else here? Yeah. Stop disrupting the class. I'm not! You are literally sat there with Peter Griffin's face behind you. <laughs> We're gonna do a mock election. Now nah, I'm going back to bed. If you were running to be Prime Minister of this school, how would you campaign? Vote for me. Okay, Michael, why? Because I said so. Oh, you sound like my mum. Oh, I love your mum. What? What? I'm Stevie. I'm Alice. And together, we're Stalis. Mm. I will increase the school week to seven days. Oh, shut up! I'll fill the vending machine with notes on how to talk to your crush. All right, one, in that case, your only customer is gonna be Tarquin. And two, I'll fill it with Freddos. Right, Gary, if you think you're so much better, what else would you do? If you want a non-uniform day every Friday, vote Gary. Mm. If you want lessons to be only five minutes, vote Gary. I'm listening. If you want Mr. McIroncock to be sacked. Wait, what? Vote Gary. A few moments later. And the winner with a record 99% of the vote is Gary. <laughs> It's time for the quarter-final. England, Switzerland. I had a dream last night that she went to Switzerland. <coughs> Missed it, Mog, go. Wow, she is straight out of the trap. That is looking good, you old flu. It's England! Thank God for that. Da -da -da. Sweet Caroline! Da -da -da. All right, everyone, settle down. Oi, sir, look what Stevie got me. That's very nice, Alice, but... Oh, that's funny, because look what Stevie got me, too. Yes, what? Uh, Roadman Reese, are you gaming? No. What are you doing, then? I'm streaming. <sighs> hey, yo, sir, look what I've got. Michael, we are here to learn, not eat. Yes, Michael, you old cabbage. Oh, give me strength. Um, can everyone stop annoying sir, please? But why? Because he's the best teacher ever. Can't be you are this in human form. Sir, look. Gary, stop it. <laughs> Gary, I won't tell you again. <laughs> Gary! <laughs> Semi-final. No. Netherlands. England. Missed it, Mog. Go. Right, it's getting serious now. Oh, no. Oh, she's turning her back on her country. She's going towards Netherlands. Oh, no, she switched last minute. She's come back to England. Comment below who you think is going to win. 
Come on, England. Uh, Come on, England. Uh, We're all singing. Da, 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 da. England. Right, you're all going on the board. Oh, bloody hell. Back to the lesson. What is hotter than the sun? Your nan. <laughs> Gary, be quiet. But why? Uh, why am I still hearing you talk? Because you've got ears, you stupid cow. <laughs> uh, why are you answering back? Well, sir, that's how a conversation kind of works. Gary, I'm running out of patience with you. What are you going to do? Send me home? <laughs> There's an idiot at the end of this remote. Really? Which end, though? <laughs> Right, Gary, that is it. You are getting an after-school online detention. When? Tonight. Ah, oh, sorry, sir, I can't tonight. Why not? I'm busy. Doing what? Your mum. <laughs> English or Spanish? Too soon. What did you think of the match? Football for this team is never coming home. What? It's bought a house in a different country. <laughs> I think Gareth Northgate needs to be sacked. It's Gareth Southgate, you moron. Okay, students, I set you all homework over the weekend. What was it again? To find a fun fact. Animals can be allergic to humans. So that's why you don't like me. You can't breathe through your nose with your tongue out. Babies on average sleep for 5,400 hours in the first year of their life. They're bloody lazy. Smiling can lower stress. No, it's not working. You can't see your ears without a mirror. Hell is real. Yeah, this skull. Right, Gary, what is your fun fact? Young people, especially students, have been absolutely robbed these last few years and the entire education system is out of date and needs reforming. That wasn't very fun, but I still think it's a fact. Yeah, fair enough. Mic drop. Oh, my bloody foot! It's the final day of term! All right, everyone, settle down. Sir, I've got you a present. Oh, show me. I'll show you at the end. Okay. Right, students, today... Uh, Michael, turn that music off. I had a £10 bet, and now I am in debt. Roadman Reed, stop trying to rap. Is there anything any of you would change about me? Your last name. Oi, sir, tell Gary to stop trying to riz my girl. Gary, stop trying to riz Stevie's girl. Hate the game, not the player. I wonder what would happen if I ate 50 Freddos. Jason, you'll make yourself sick. I can't wait until tomorrow because I get better looking every day. I'm starting to get annoyed now. Oi, sir, I just typed in stupid idiot on Google and guess what came up? What? A picture of you! <laughs> uh, sir, I hope you're going to give us homework over the summer. Oh, you're all going to get more than that. What? The summer holidays are cancelled. What? We're going to have online school all throughout the summer. Wow, Gary, that silence I hear. Oh, Gary, I almost forgot. Show me that present you got me. I locked Sir in the bathroom. Detention. I swore at Sir when we were on Zoom. Detention. I got caught selling sweets at break time. Detention. I covered Sir in green slime. D -d 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 Detention. I forgot to show my working out. Detention. I told Miss she looked like a trout. Detention. I got caught running down the corridor. Detention. I did a wee on the classroom floor. Welcome to online summer school. Why are you making us do this? Because you are an absolute disgrace to this school and our country. That is not a very nice way to talk about your mum. <laughs> okay, everyone, today's question. Is social media a force for good or bad? I think it's bad because I'm always comparing myself to other people. Alice, you know you're amazing just the way you are. Are you reading the lyrics to a Bruno Mars song to me? What? No. I don't have time for social media. Yeah, because you're too busy out there kissing pigeons. That was one time! <laughs> okay, let's get back on track. I got double digit likes on my post last week. I'm basically a celebrity. I'm perfect for social media because people need to have their eyes blessed by my presence. I haven't got social media, but I've got TikTok and YouTube. Oh my God, I'm losing the will to live here. And finally, Gary, what do you think of social media? This is what I think of social media. Sometimes it may be good, sometimes it may be shit. Keep up, losers. Oh, I don't need this. <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, where is Sarah? Uh, Tarquin, why are you not in your kit? I'm too intelligent to be doing sports. Oi, Tarquin. Yes? <sighs> uh, Road Memories, why are you not doing anything? I think I've caught asthma off someone. Wait, what? Here we go. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> shot put, shot put, shot put. Sir, around the world. Not bad. Sir, what about long jump? Not bad. Okay, what about gymnastics? 
Not bad. Say not bad one more time and I'll cut off your skin and wear it as a coat. Right, you just threatened me. Get down and give me 20. Oh, fine, but I was hoping to get a McFlurry after this. Knock, knock. Who's there? What, when? What, when, who? Dinner. This week, me and you. Okay, Gary, I've called this meeting with you and all your teachers because there's a rat in my kitchen, what am I gonna do? All right, anyway, we've got Miss Smith, Mr. Elements, Mr. Cliche, Miss Karen, and Mr. Nipple. It's Nipple. Gary, why do you not take my science lesson seriously? Because I don't care about the cells of a bloody leaf. Gary, why do you get so annoyed with your teammates during PE? I am not a bin man. I can't carry trash. There is no I in team. No, but there is one in Gary. No, there isn't. Oh yeah. Gary, I have just one question. No, I don't want to marry you, you old fart. Gary, to win on to Monsieur vs. Et and Clown. Okay, that's it. I want to speak to your parents. You can't. Why? They're away on holiday. Where? Jamaica. So you're home alone? Yep. You're not going to be having a house party, are you? I've never seen a fist in my life! Students, this is not funny. Oh. Well, that depends on which side of the screen you're on. How do I turn this setting off? Press Control Alt Delete. Control Alt Delete. Now press End Task. End Task. <laughs> Students, I am starting to get very annoyed. Oi, sir, can I ask a question? Yes. What's that small wooden thing you hit the ball off in golf? Tea? Ah, uh, that'd be great. Two sugars, please. <laughs> Alice, I can't hear you. Hang on, let me turn you up full blast. <laughs> Students, your behaviour needs to improve by September. But why? Because our new school building is going to be built by then. <laughs> and no, you will not burn it down again. Oi, sir, I can make you turn your hands over without touching you. What? Put your hands out. No, the other way. <laughs> I need to win the lottery. Me, whenever I try and talk to my crush. <laughs> Okay, students, today I want you to say a meme caption and then follow it up with a matching video. Me, whenever I hear a politician speaking. Why lying for? When my mum sees how many cups and plates are in my room. Unacceptable condition! Me, when someone tries to show me a photo of their baby. <laughs> me, when I was trying to convince Alice to go out with me. And if it dies there, so be it. But I want us to f Try! Me, when they tell me the ice cream machine is broken at McDonald's. No, no. Me, when I become more successful than all of you. You all laughed at me. Well, I have to say, you're not laughing now, are you? And finally, Gary, you're up. Me, whenever you ask me to do homework over the weekend. No! We can go ban for ban. Uh, Gary, you are not Central C. Forget Central C, it's all about Central G. Okay, today's question. Should students have a role in hiring teachers at their school? Yes, seeing as we're the ones that have to be taught by them. Oi, so let's do a mock interview with you right now. All right, let's go. What is the one thing you couldn't live without? My friends. The only friends you have are this lot. Sing a song that best describes you. Simply the best. Yeah, bloody not. Who is your hero? Probably Mr. Bean. Oh, I wish you spoke as little as he does. What? What? I don't need to ask you any questions, sir, because I would definitely give you the job. Thank you, Tarquin. Ugh. Which emoji best describes you? This one. Nah, this one best describes you because you're a clown. Right, Gabby, ask me an interview question and make it quick. Sell me this pen. Well, pens are good if you want to write something down, and if you want to write something down, a, a, a pen would be good. The good news is... Is I would give you the job. Ah, brilliant. The bad news is this is what I would say to you a week later. Yeah! Oh, bloody hell! Gary, what's wrong? Have you ever thought you were in love with someone but then realised you were just staring in a mirror for 20 minutes? Okay, students, let's have a debate. Which snack is the best? Crisps or chocolate? The only snack I like is Miss Smith. Crisps are superior because chocolate makes me feel sick. Yeah, a bit like your breath. Chocolate, because I've got the taste buds of a two-year-old. Yeah, and the same brain as one. You can't beat a bowl of cereal. What about donuts? Ah, oh, donuts. Uh, students, let's focus on the actual question. What was it again? Crisps or chocolate? Popcorn. Oh, for goodness sake. Biscuits. Oh. <sighs> oh, custard creams. Students. Cookies. Oh. <sighs> oh, this lesson is making me feel hungry. Oh, students, we're starting to lose focus here. Carrot sticks. What are you, a rabbit? <sighs> uh, Gary, where do you think you're going? 
to get a muck Gary. A muck what? A muck Gary. <laughs>